Welcome to the Expense Cloud Tutorials on Adding Receipts. There are three ways to add receipts inside of Expense Cloud. The first one is by adding the receipt from your computer. The second is by emailing the receipt. And the third is using Expense Cloud mobile apps or any camera phone. Let's start by adding a receipt from my computer. These can be receipts you scanned in, screenshots of receipts, or files you've received. Select the Add button in the column under Receipts. A box will appear asking you to browse your computer for the file name. Choose the file name and select OK. A receipt icon will be displayed, showing a receipt is attached. There is no limit on how many receipts you can add to an expense. Place your mouse over the receipt icon to view the thumbnail. Click the icon to view a larger image of the receipt. The second way of getting receipts into Expense Cloud is via email. You can forward receipts you receive via email directly to receipts at expensecloud.com. They must be sent using the same email address you use to log into Expense Cloud. If you have a camera phone, you can also take a picture of the receipt and forward it directly to receipts at expensecloud.com. Any of the receipts sent will appear in the Receipts tab, which we call the Unassigned Receipt folder. Once they're here, all you need to do is drag and drop the image to the proper expense. The icon being displayed next to the expense tells you that the receipt is now attached. The last way of getting receipts into Expense Cloud is through our mobile apps for Blackberry, Android, and iPhone. Users have the option of taking pictures of receipts, selecting pictures stored in their camera library, or selecting a receipt from the unassigned receipt folder. From the app, you can add a receipt to a new expense or an existing expense. You can also select the Add a Receipt button on the home screen to send the receipt to your unassigned receipt folder. To delete or move a receipt, go to the Expense tab, select Edit Details underneath the expense itself, where the receipt was attached. Your options are deleting the receipt, moving the receipt to another expense, or moving the receipt back to the unassigned receipt folder.